So today we are building this amazing static website and we will be using Next.js 13 to just build this amazing static website from start to end. And uh, just this website will be not really of the big website. It will be simple website, but it will be static website and nobody has built this amazing static website using Next.js 13. If you see on YouTube, everybody has built these static website or HTML, CSS or JavaScript like languages, but I'm building it using Next.js 13 and showing you how to just build these amazing simple websites using Next.js 13 also. So just now I will be giving you the demo of this and showing you what are the things included in this. First of all, you will be getting the uh, name of the title like I've written Lizzo 5 template because I've just taken this website design from the template here but I've just do that all design using Next.js 13 and we will be changing the title as well from here. Then we are getting the title here or you can say the logo where it is written Lizom. You can put any other logo as well or you can put any text here also. Then at the right we are getting the navbar menus like home services, portfolio, features, team, testimonials, contact. You can put many other navbar menus as well but I put these all navbar menus which I will be needing of. Then we are just getting this title which is saying that we are creative agency, creative people. Then you will be getting the paragraph about this site here and we are getting a simple contact button in which we are getting a light black hover effect at the back and all the things are same then at the back we are also getting the image which is looking awesome and we are getting the transparent effect as well on that image which is looking good then if i move to the services section so we are getting the services here like uh, what the what this website provide the services they provide graphic designing coding photograph photography hacking web designing ui design means if anybody wants to create if anybody wants to create their own website so they can move here and then they can just give the website to the user to build that and you can also see we have just written simple lorem ipsum tag in every service section because i don't need to write any text here you can write text as well if you want to make it professionally so i will be moving to portfolio now these are the portfolio means the project built by the user you will be getting here like you will be also getting the project title or subtitle if you want to write here but i have not written any project title or subtitle here you can put as well if you want to just put that then i will be moving to features here after moving to features you will be now getting the features here like uh feature we are just getting here you can write here feature one feature two feature three feature four feature five or feature six you can also write the name as well of the features if you want to write but i have not written here i have just only written the feature and the paragraph about that here then if I move down on the team section, here you will be getting the team like you will be getting the profile of the team section, the name of the team member. Then down you will be getting the category like in which category this team member is. And then here you will be getting the paragraph about this team member like what he do and what is uh, his skillful thing which he do. Uh, you will be getting that all thing. And then you will be also if you hover on this image, you will be getting the links of the uh, team member like if you want to see their facebook page twitter page instagram page or github page you can check that by pressing this icons then if i move on this testimonial section you will be getting the testimonials like what are the testimonial reviews how they prefer this website and if they are just success if they are just uh, you can say comfortable with this website so they can also rate it and they have rate four stars rating you can see you can also make it five star rating or three star or two star or one star or you can also take all the star empty so user can understand that this website is not having any rating so we will be not giving our contract or our work to this website then i will be moving to contact section because this was the testimonial section you will be also getting the paragraph about testimonial means what have what testimonial has written about this website you can put any of that but i have uh, put this uh, random text here again then i'll be moving to contact in the contact section you will be getting but before at the top we are getting this facebook google youtube and webflow pinterest and facebook logos here and at the back we are getting the light peach color you can say then if i move down here we are just getting the contact section in which we are getting at the left image of the uh, restaurant like and then at the right we are getting the name input box email input box and then you will be getting here message so you can put any of the message and you can press submit button to submit your message to the user of this website then if i move down we are just getting this let's build something great you can get started here by pressing this button and you can just make your own thing if you want to build or if you want to build any other thing which is great so you can build that we are also getting the background pink color here then in the footer we are just getting again the lizome logo like we are getting here at the top on the nav bar we are getting the paragraph about the website here we are getting all the uh, you can say all the pay icon logos like facebook twitter instagram github then at the right we are also getting navigation in which we are getting all these 
venues which are looking awesome then in more we are getting faq privacy policy licenses then we are getting the contact section in which we are getting the address of the user number of the user and the email of the user here we are just getting the copyright section in which we are getting this agency 2021 all right reserved then we are getting created uh, with love by uh, then you can just write here your name as well if you have built it so just we are building this amazing static website using nextjs 13 and we'll be including some of the other languages as well like steps and dark mode graphql node.js react to build this from start so just i hope you'll be understanding this video and if you understand it uh, if you enjoy this video so hit a like and if you want to see more videos like that so hit the subscribe on this channel and after subscribing hit notification bell from which you'll be notified with all the future videos and share this video as well so more people can learn and they can take benefit of these amazing things so just now we'll be starting with our video and seeing how to build this amazing project of a static website using Next.js 13. Hello friends and assalamu alaikum. Welcome to my channel. I be all designing developer. Like in the previous videos, we have just done many of the things using e-commerce and we have covered up many of the stuff using e-commerce sites like we have built many of the different e-commerce sites and I hope you enjoy that. So just I think that now we have built many of the e-commerce sites using Next.js 13 and different languages like React and then we have also used Stacks and GraphQL, Dark Mode and many other stuff to build that. But today we are also using Next.js in our project and we will be now building a different website using Next.js 13. Today I will be telling you how to build a simple static website using Next.js 13. And this static website will be really simple website because we are building it using Next.js 13. And I will be telling you if you want to build a start website means if you want to build a beginner website. So how to build that using Next.js 13 and this is the static website which we are building. So this video will be different from the others and it will be not you can say the advanced level video it will be beginner level video because we are building a static website here using nextjs 13 and if you enjoy this video and learn things from this video so hit a like and if you want to see more videos like that so hit the subscribe on this channel and after subscribing hit notification bell from which you'll be notified with all the future coming up videos and also share this video so more people can learn and they can take very good of these amazing things i'll be uploading more videos like that in future that will giving you help so remember to check that out videos also because that will also giving you help but now we'll be starting with today's video and seeing how to build our today's project of a static website from start we will be using nextjs 13 and server side languages like steps and react node.js graphql dark mode and many others so just now we'll be starting with that and seeing how to build it from start to end so just like i'm telling you we'll be building an amazing static website using nextjs 13 so just now we'll be starting with our video and seeing what is static website and how to build it from start so for building this static website here i will be opening my vs code so you can see here when you've opened this i will be closing all the folders which we are getting here or you can say i will be making a new window so we don't have to uh, just remove any folder i'll be moving and pressing open folder then this is our folder of a static website here which we have just used so here i will be now pressing select folder then you have to move in this file and then here I will be moving to this file and erasing all the stuff from here because I will be not needing these all things. So here after removing this thing here you have to now move and remove this thing as well. Here I will be just doing one thing guy. Here I will be moving then I will be making a body tag here and in this body tag I will be now first of all making a tag of HTML then write here body. Here when you have written this I will be copying this tag or you can say just say yes. So we are getting this tag here. So I will be now erasing this tag from here because now we will be not needing. So when you've written this thing just here, you have to give a space from here. Then save this file directly. And after saving, just you have to now move to this file as well. And after moving to this file here, I will be now moving down. And then you have to now just move here and then say, save it. Here also save it here. Press Ctrl V to close side panel. Here I will be opening it in my default Google Chrome browser. This is the folder and this is our file. So now we are getting the title of uh, Lizome Bootstrap 5 template. So here I will be erasing this and writing here next year. So here I will be moving and then you have to write the Lizome, uh, you can say e commerce or you can say static website in next year, like this. Then when you've written this here, you have to save, reload. Now we are getting that title change here. We are getting a static website in next year. So here you have to move in the body tag, right here BS spy then right here is scroll here you have to move right here data bs target is equals to then after writing this tag here i will be now writing here dot nav bar and when you've written this here i will be moving right here nav right class here which should be nav bar fixed then i will be writing top nav bar like this then here i will be writing expand lg here you have to now write nav bar dash light and here i will be writing bg wide 
here you have to move down and after moving down right here div class container and then you have to just move down right here a tag and after writing a tag you have to write class navbar and then write here brand so here i will be writing navbar brand then here you have to now just write here logo text like this and then here you have to move in this href right here this hashtag in which i will be writing lizom you can write any other logo name as well here then i will be writing button and here you have to write class and then in class i will be now giving it navbar toggler like this then here you have to write type is equals to button here you have to now write data bs toggle is equals to right here collapse then when you written this here i will be writing here data bs target is equals to right here navbar nav then you have to give a space here then right here area controls is equals to then i will be writing here navbar right here nav then you have to now write here area expanded false so here i will be writing then you have to just now write here area label is equals to then i will be writing here toggle navigation so here i will be writing this then you have to write here span class then after writing this here i will be writing navbar toggler right here icon then write here def class then i will be writing collapse navbar dash then i will be writing here collapse write here id then write here navbar nav then i will be writing here ul class then i will be writing navbar nav ms auto then you have to move down write here li class nav item then i will be now moving a tag and here before this i'll be writing class nav link then when you have written this here i will be moving right here home then here you have to write home as well copy this here nav bar from here then after copying here i will be just pasting it yes paste 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 here i will be moving and then here i will be writing about then i will be now writing here about us then you have to move down and here i will be just now writing services then after writing services here i will be now writing here services as well then you have to now move here right here portfolio then here uh, also i will be writing here portfolio then when you have written this here i will be moving and after moving here i will be writing uh, features so here i will be writing then you have to write here features as well like this then when you have written this here i will be moving then write here team and here also i will be writing team and then here you have to now just write here testimonial so here i will be now writing testimonials like this then when you have written this here also i will be writing testimonials then when you have written this save reload now we are getting all this stuff here if i show you so you can see we are getting about us and in this about us i will be now writing here a tag which will be like uh, control z then when you return this here i will be now writing services so here i will be writing services like this here i will be moving then you have to copy this by pressing control c and here we have to paste it then you have to move here copy this tag from here then you have to paste it here so paste it then we have to copy this then here i will be now pasting it and here you have to now copy this tag and then here you have to paste here and then copy this from here and then you have to paste it here and after pasting here i will be now just moving and then writing here contact now it is good so here i will be now just writing here contact also here so here i will be writing contact then here you have to now write testimonials so here i will be writing testimonials now when you have written this here i will be now just moving after this write here team and then move at the top and after moving here i will be now just writing here features so here i will be now writing here features like this then move at the top as well and here i will be writing portfolio and here i will be now moving and then write here services save this reload now if i show you so we will be now getting it perfect so when you have written this just you have to now move after the nav tag here which we have written so i will be moving after the nav tag here right here section id and here i will be writing home then you have to write here div class container text center so here when you have written this here i will be now moving down right here div class and right here row 
justify content center so when you return this here i will be writing this last call md so here i will be writing call md 10 then i will be writing h1 class text then i will be writing here white and right here display or then i will be writing we are creative agency then i will be writing here creative like this then i will be writing people and when you written this here i will be writing p tag class and here you have to write text and then write here white here you have to now write it is a law then i will be writing established and here i will be writing fact data or you can say you can write any lorem epsom tag here so I will be writing this. Then when you return this here, I will be writing a tag. Right here, contact class, and write btn btn dash brand. Here I will be writing contact save. Then reload. So now we are getting this here button. Then when you are getting here, I will be moving down. Right here, section id service. Here you have to now just write here services. Then you have to write this class container like this. Then after writing here i will be moving right here div class row then i will be writing here div class then i will be writing call 12 section right here intro then you have to write here h1 and in h1 i will be writing our services here you have to write div so in div i will be writing class which will be h9 then here when you written this i will be writing div class row and here you have to move down and after moving down here i will be just writing Div class and right here call lg4 right here call sm6 e4 then i will be writing here div class and write icon box so here i will be writing then i will be just moving down right here i type class bx bxs landscape like this then here when you've written this right here h4 class then i will be writing title sm and then right here mt4 right here graphic designing then when you've written this here i will be moving down right here p tag then i will be writing lorem tag here then when you've written this here i will be now writing right here diff class then i will be writing call lg4 right here call sm6 then right here p4 here you have to move down right here diff class icon box then right here i tag class here i will be writing bx bxs coffee like this then when you've written this here i will be writing h4 class title then when you've written this here i'll be writing smmt4 then i will be just moving right here photography like this then i will be just moving down right here p tag lorem tag here then when you've written this thing just here i will be moving down after this tag just now you have to copy this thing by pressing ctrl c and here i will be pasting it down and after pasting just here i will be changing the uh, name here i will be writing check shield like this then here i will be now moving and here i will be writing hacking so here you have to write then here you have to move down after this tag again here i will be pasting it then i will be now just changing the font name means the name of the uh here so here i will be writing vx laptop then save this here i will be moving and then write here web designing like this save then after saving here you have to now just write here vxx image so here i will be now writing image like this then here you have to move at the top and then after moving at the top you can see we have just uh, written all this stuff and you can see we have just written this thing now here we are just also getting the coding written here so i will be now copying this tag then you have to paste it here and here i will be now writing copy so here you have to write copy then write here coding like this so when you've written this save and here you have to reload so now you can see we are getting all this stuff and now i will be moving in the hacking here so now in the hacking here we are just getting this image in the photography so when you are getting all this stuff so you have to now just write here shield like this save this then you have to reload here so now we are getting this in web designing we are getting the laptop as well now when you are getting this thing just here i will be moving pasting it again just changing the name of the uh, icon here i will be writing happy art eyes then here i will be now writing ui design so here you have to move right here ui design save this then you have to reload now you can see we are getting this thing then here i will be just moving down 
write here section id write here portfolio and here i will be writing class row g0 where i will be writing py0 here you have to write def class call lg4 then i will be writing call sn6 here you have to now just move down right here def class here i will be writing portfolio then i will be writing item here i will be moving down right here image then when you have written this here i will be writing image slash p1 dot jpeg then here i will be moving down right here diff class portfolio then i will be writing overlay here when you have written this just i will be writing diff h3 right here project title then when you have written this here i will be now writing h6 and here i will be writing project subtitle and when you have written this thing just here i will be now moving after the four divs here which we have written right here diff class call lg4 then when you have written this here i will be now pasting the tag which we have just copied there here when you have written all this thing just here i will be now writing diff right here class call lg4 right here call sm6 then you have to move down right here diff class and write portfolio right here item then i will be moving right here image image slash p2 so here i will be now writing jpeg here you have to move down right diff class then i will be writing portfolio right here overlay then i will be moving down right here div h3 then here i will be writing project title like this then i will be now moving down right here h3 project subtitle like this then when you've written this say and after saving here i will be now just copying this tag here by pressing control c so these are the four divs here so i will be now pressing control c here then when you've written this thing just here i will be now pasting it down then i will be changing into p3 so here when you've written this here i will be now just moving down after this tag right here p4 then here you have to move down right here p5 and here i will be now just moving down right here p6 like this then when you've written this here i will be now just uh, doing one thing as well save it then i will be writing section like this right here id features then i will be writing diff class container so here i will be now writing then right here diff class row here you have to write diff class then i will be writing here call 12 section intro so here i will be writing right here h1 write cover features like this then here you have to move down right here diff class and then write here h line here you have to now write diff class and write row gy4 then i will be writing diff class and here i will be writing call lg4 here you have to write call sn6 feature then i will be writing d flags here you have to write diff class and then write here icon box and write here me dash 3 then i will be writing here item class vx vx then here i will be now just writing here check and then when you've written this here i will be writing div h5 right here class which should be title sm then i will be writing here feature and when you've written this here i will be writing p tag right here lorem then when you've written this here i will be now just writing this tag here again so here i will be now copying this two divs here till this here so here i will be now copying this tag by pressing ctrl c here you have to paste it then here i will be pasting it again then when you've written this here you have to now just do one thing here we have just pasted two times the code so here we are just getting it so here we are just getting it one two three four and five six times here we are getting this so here i will be now just doing one thing here we are getting it one two three four five so we are getting it five times here i will be now pasting it again so now we are getting it six times now when you are getting all this stuff so here i will be just now moving after the section tag as well reload now you can see we are getting all this thing project title subtitle and the images as well then we are getting this features icon here also then you have to move after the section tag right here section id right here team then you have to write class which should be row g zero so here i will be writing py dash zero tag center 
then when you return this here i will be moving right here diff class right call lg3 call sm6 team member like this then i'll be writing diff class and here you have to write team member right here image then you have to write image and then after writing image i'll be writing image slash team v then when you return this here i will be moving right here diff class social icons then i will be writing here a tag right here i tag class then i will be writing vx bxl dash facebook then here you have to now copy this tag here by pressing ctrl c so when you return this space 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 then here i will be moving and after moving here you have to write here github then you have to now just write instagram you can put any of the icon here like i am putting these all icons you can put here any other icon as well here i will be putting twitter then when you return this here you can write diff class p4 then you can write here h5 and in h5 you can write the title sm mt3 then you have to write here mb0 text white then here i will be writing the name here like i will be writing my name like this so when you return this here i will be writing small then i will be writing class here i will be writing text white then i will be writing web and then write here web designer so here i will be writing designer then i will be now writing div class here i will be writing h9 then when you return this here you have to write beta write class text white so here i will be writing then i will be now just writing here well so here i will be writing well skillful or here you can write any law in it some tag also here now you have to save this and after saving just you have to now move here after this tag and after moving to this tag here i will be now just copying this tag here as well then you have to now paste it here and after pasting just you have to now change its name so here i will be now writing here like alexander then you have to save and change the image as well like here i will be now writing here uh, team 4 so here i will be writing this team 4 here then when you written this here i will be now just doing one thing here i will be moving down pasting it then you can write here uh, other name like here i will be now writing john david then save this here you have to move and then here you have to write 6 then you have to save here reload now if i show you you can see we are getting different images here with the same profile here uh, now when you are just getting these all stuff so here i will be moving after this tag here so you can see we have just written this and after writing this here i will be moving down then you have to paste it again here i will be now writing teammate like this then here i will be now writing another name so here i will be writing uh, the name of uh, like this save then reload so now here we are just getting the images again so here i will be moving in this then i will be now writing here uh, the name so here i will be writing aaron like this then here when you've written this here i will be writing aaron one save reload now we are getting this so when you are just uh, done with these all things here you have to now move to the testimonial section so here i will be moving after this step right here section id testimonials like this then when you written this here i will be writing class text center then i will be writing this class container here you have to now write this class row here i will be moving right here this class call 12 here you have to now write ul class here i will be writing nav right here nav fills justify content center then i will be writing here mv3 so here you have to move right here id is equals to fills tab like this here you have to now just write here role is equals to tab list here you have to now just write li class right here nav item then i will be writing here role presentation like this then i will be writing here a tag which will be like button and in button i will be writing class nav link and here i will be writing active right here id is equals to pills and right here home tag right here data bs toggle is equals to right here pill right here data bs target is equals to right here pills home like this 
then right here type is equals to so here i will be now writing type is equals to button and here you have to move again right here role is equals to tab then right area controls is equals to right here fills home then i will be writing area select it is equals to true then you have to now just write here image source will be image slash team four and then when you return this here i'll be now just moving here as well copy this whole tag which we have written and then paste it here and after pasting just you have to now write here team six paste it then here i will be now writing team six and here as well i will be writing team eight now when you return this here you have to move after the ul tag right here diff class then i'll be writing here tab content right here id fills then i'll be writing tab content then when you return this here i will be now just moving down right here diff class and right here tab pane right here fade show then i will be writing here active here you have to now just do one thing like here i'll be writing id and right here fills form like this then i will be writing here role is equals to tab panel then right here area label uh, labeled by is equals to then i will be writing fills home tab then when you return this here i will be now just moving down right here div class review so here i will be writing then right here div class stars and then right here i tag class uh, bx bxs stars then when you return this just here you have to copy this tag by pressing ctrl c then paste it paste it and after pasting here so here now we will be pasting it again four five six now here i will be removing this as from here then when you return this here i will be now just moving here like this save and then when you return these all things here i will be writing p tag and after writing p tag here i will be writing class lead here you have to write lorem ipsum tag here then after writing here i will be writing h5 write class which should be title sm then i will be writing mb0 so here i will be writing then right here the name so here i will be writing my name again then right here small tag and here i will be writing web developer so here when you written this save and after saving just you have to now do one thing as well like here i will be now doing one thing here i will be moving in this tag and after moving here you have to now copy this tag as well from here like this so here now we have just uh, written after the two diffs so here i will be now copying this tag here and after copying this tag here i will be pasting it here then when you've written this i will be changing the name here i will be now writing alexander save then when you've written this here you have to now just do one thing like here i will be now writing here web designer so here i will be now writing web designer then here you have to move down paste it then i will be now just writing here graphic designer so here i will be now writing like this save this then you have to reload it here so if i show you you can see we are getting all this stuff here as well now when you are getting these all things here i will be now just doing one thing here i will be moving after this section tag right here section id right clients then i will be writing class vg light like this then i will be moving right here diff class container so here i will be writing then you have to write here diff class row and here i will be writing gy dash 4 then i will be now writing diff class right here call lg2 then right here call md3 right call 6 then i will be writing here image image slash then i will be writing logo so here i will be writing logo 1 dot svg then when you've written this here i will be now copying this tag and after a copy just paste it here like this paste it as well then i'll be writing here logo 2 here i'll be writing logo 3 then you have to paste it here and after pasting just here i will be pasting it again then you have to write here logo 4 write here logo 5 then write here logo 1 again now when you've written this here i will be just now moving down right here section and then right here id contact then i will be writing here diff class so here i will be now writing diff class container and after writing this container you have to write here diff class row then right here align items center then you have to write here diff class and right here call lg-4 then right here image source should be image slash then i will be now writing here 
tag dot jpeg right here diff class right call lg6 then i'll be writing offset dash lg and then right here one here you have to move down and after moving down here i will be writing form then i will be raising the section directly from here and here i will be writing diff and after writing this div, I'll be writing class mb3. Here you have to now write a small tag, and in a small, I'll be writing name. Here you have to move down, right here, input type should be text, and here I'll be writing class form control, then I'll be writing id, and then I'll be writing here example input email, and here I will be just now writing here area described, then I will be writing here by is equals to right here email help. Then when you've written this, here I will be now writing uh, again this thing. So here I will be copying this div. Then I will be now pasting it here. So here when you've written this, I will be now writing email. So when you've written this, here I will be pasting it. Then when you've written this, uh, here you have to now just write here message. Then you have to save. Here I will be now just doing one thing. I will be moving here. Then I will be writing here, control Z, right? text area then when you return this here i will be writing name so simply here i will be moving in this tag and after moving here you have to now just erase all this stuff like we are getting so here i will be moving in this so when you just move in this tag here you have to erase all the things from here so now when you've written these all things here you have to now write text area and after writing text area here i will be writing name is equals to id is equals to right here cost 30 right here rows is equals to 4 right class form control then when you've written this close this tag here and after closing this here i will be now just moving down right here button right type is equals to submit then after writing this here i will be writing class btn btn dash brand then right here submit save this then after moving down here you have to now just move after this tag right here section id cta then right here class which should be py p5 so here i will be writing py then right here diff class container so here when you've written this i will be now writing py4 then right here diff class row then i will be writing justify content center then i will be just now moving here right here diff class call md then i will be writing 6 here you have to write h3 class and here i will be writing text Right. Then I will be now writing here let's build something great like this thing. Then when you've written this here I will be writing diff class and after writing this here I will be writing call auto. Here you have to move down right here a tag. Now here we have to write btn btn live and here I will be now just writing get started. So here I will be writing. Then you have to save and here I will be moving down. And now here I will be just now writing a tag from which we will be getting all the stuff here. So here you have to now move in this tag, right here diff class and then right here footer top. So here I will be writing. Then right here diff class and after writing diff class here I will be writing container. So here I will be writing. Then you have to write here diff class then I will be writing row gy-5. Here I will be writing diff class call md. Then after writing this here I will be writing 4. Then you have to write here h4 class logo. Then I will be now writing here logo dash text. Then I will be writing Lizzo. Save. Then you have to move down right here this lorem tag again. Now when you've written this thing, just here you have to move down. And after moving down right here div class, right here social icons. Then you have to move down. Control Z. Right here a tag. Right. Control Z. And then here. You have to write control z here as well right here i tag class bx bxl facebook then i will be writing copying this tag so here i will be now just doing one thing i will be copy this tag from here then i will be now uh, pasting it here i will be now just moving here right here github and i will be just now moving here and then writing here instagram then you have to write here twitter as well so here i will be now writing then when you return this here i will be now just doing one thing like here i will be now uh, just moving down right here diff class and after writing diff class here i will be writing call md2 here you have to now move down right here h5 class here i will be writing title as sent then i will be writing 
navigation here you have to now write dev class and here i will be writing footer and write links here you have to move down right here it is right services here i will be moving down copy this tag from here paste it paste it paste it then here i will be now writing log and here i will be moving down then i will be writing here team and then here i will be now just writing here our work so here i will be writing this tag then when you return this here i will be moving down right here diff class call md2 then i will be writing h5 class right here title sm then i will be writing here more and after writing just you have to save reload now you can see we are getting these all stuff here moving down and when you are getting this thing just here i will be now doing one thing else like here i will be writing diff now we have to get the footer links as well because we have written all the links here so we want footer links here also then when you return this footer links here i will be now writing a tag right here faqs then when you return this here i will be now just writing here privacy and policy like this so here i will be writing then when you return this here i will be now writing here a tag and after writing this a tag here i will be now writing licenses then i will be now writing the class call md2 then here you have to now just uh, write a tag which should be like h5 class here i will be writing title sm then here i will be writing contact and then here you have to write diff class footer then i will be now writing links here you have to move down and after moving down write here class mv then here i will be now writing 16 49 then here i will be now just writing here norman street like this then here i will be writing los angeles like this thing then i will be writing 9001 you can write any other address here if you want to write right here mb again then i will be writing 8 800 then you have to write here 316 dash 06 dash 42 then write here p tag and then write here class mb here i will be writing hello at the rate your domain dot com then when you return this thing just here i will be then i will be now moving down after the five divs here you have to write div class footer and then i will be writing here bottom here you have to move down right here div class and right here container here you have to now just write div class right here row justify content then here you have to write between then right here gy dash 3 here i will be moving down right here diff class then right here call mb6 then when you have written this right here p tag class is equals to mb0 then i will be writing here copyright so here i will be now writing this at the rate and right here copy then i will be writing here my name and then right here 2023 right here all rights reserved so here i will be now writing this then when you have written this here i will be now moving down after this tag and write here diff class and then after writing class here i will be writing call auto so here i will be now writing call auto then i will be writing p tag and after writing p tag write here mb auto or you can say mb0 then here in this i will be writing created with love so here i will be now writing by and here i will be writing my name as well save this then reload now if i show you you can see we are getting this copyright section like copyright in shall 2023 already reserved then this is the copyright created with love when shall we like i was just showing you when we are writing and now you can see this is our website which we have created this is our static website which i want to show you these are the things which we have written like the title which i have shown you in the demo when we are just working at when i was just showing you the demo the title has been changed you can see at the top i have written static website in next year the logo has been same here then if i scroll down we are getting our services menu in which we are getting text and the uh, different services like graphic designing coding pro photography hacking web designing ui design then these are the project made by the user here then these are the feature menu you can just put any feature as well here then these are, this is a profile section you will be getting the profile of the user uh, and you will be also just you can see here i've written my name then you will be getting the different names with the different skills of the user then you will be also getting the paragraph here written about the user then if i move down we are just getting this again the profile here of the users different three profiles i have written here then if i move down we are just getting the 
यू कैन से द लोगोज हेयर ऑफ द मेन यू कैन से ऑफ द मेन कंपनीज लाइक फेसबुक गूगल यूट्यूब वेब लो इंटरेस्ट एंड फेसबुक अगेन एंड यू कैन पुट ए मैनी अदर लोगो एज वेल देन वी आर जस्ट गेटिंग दिस फोटो हेयर ऑफ द you can say of this image we are getting in the contact then we are getting the name email and the message you want to write to this user of the website and you can press submit to submit your message which you want to write here then we are again getting this let's build something great here like i was just showing you in the demo here we are getting the pinkish color at the background and we are getting get started button here to build something great on this then we are getting again the logo about the website things then we are getting logos here like facebook twitter instagram and github then we are getting navigation link more link contact section here you will be getting the address number and the email of the user here we will be doing some change here we have written the spelling mistake so here i will be now saving this then i will be moving and now you can see our email spelling is good previously it was written double e now it is double l and o so now it is good here then we are just getting this copyright section in which i have written my name 2023 previously it was written agency 2022 and i have written all right deserved in capital letter means first letter is capital of all right deserved and we are just getting the name of mine here i have written created with love by inshallah previously we were getting the logo but i have written the name you can put logo as well if you want to put but i think logo will be not putting here so now i hope you understand how we have built this amazing static website using next year's 13 and i hope you understand this how we have built it from start to end if you understand enjoy this video so hit a like and if you want to see more videos like that so hit the subscribe on this channel and after subscribing hit notification bell from which you will be notified with all the future videos i'll be uploading more videos like that in future as well so just i'll be meet you next project with more amazing things or more amazing tutorials for today good bye